Hey y'all, it's your girl Bree. For those that are new, welcome to my channel. And if you are not new, welcome back. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing an apple cider vinegar scratch that. I'm doing an Aztec clay mask using apple cider vinegar. So I've never done one of these before. Um, I always watch videos on it though. And I was like, hey, let me go ahead and try it and see how it does on my hair i've seen so many good videos where this clay mask like cleanses the hair and makes the curls pop and like people all over youtube looking bomb okay i got a blowout and my end strand about two weeks ago so my hair has been in this state for about two weeks and now it's time to wash it because she is dirty and to be honest i miss my curls and i'm using health the health and beauty aztec secret version 2 indian healing clay it says it's the world's most powerful facial deep pore cleansing natural calcium benotype clay so it's my understanding that you can use this for um your hair as well as your skin so yeah today i'm going to be using it for my hair maybe if y'all want to see i'll use it for my skin leave a comment down below if you would like to see that and i'm going to be using the bragg organic raw unfiltered apple cider vinegar I'm going to be pairing this with the clay on the um, on this jar it says that you can either use the apple cider vinegar <clears throat> excuse me on the jar it says you can either use apple cider vinegar or water but most of the videos I've seen say that the apple cider vinegar work better so that's what I'm going to be using and I got both of these products from Amazon so shout out to Amazon because it came through free girl I have two little plastic bowls here I was looking at how big they were. I grabbed two from downstairs in the kitchen because I was like, mm, one might not be enough. They're pretty small. And I also have this little plastic spoon that I'm gonna use to mix it up. It says do not use metal with this. Um, you don't wanna blow your kitchen up or your room or whatever, so make sure you use plastic. On the jar, it says use a non-metal bowl and utensil stir the mixture well to a smooth paste add more clay or liquid as needed apply one eighth to one fourth hold up i'm reading the wrong instructions that's how to apply it to your face okay so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna just add some clay in and then we're gonna add some apple cider vinegar until i think i have enough so here we go <laughs>
So I have it all throughout my hair and y'all the clay gets messy okay so if you can put down some towels or something before you do this um also I probably should have did it in the bathroom because it got all over my curtain all over my little comforter but I just took a damp towel and just kind of you know dabbed it and wiped it off and it came right out so that's good easy cleanup but to avoid all of that just make sure you put something down so that if any drips or flies like mine did you would have something to catch it um but yeah so my hair is getting hard this side as y'all saw i did first so this side is getting um it's more hard than this side and this side has been sitting for about 15 to 20 minutes this side has been sitting between five and ten minutes so what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna go take a shower and i'm gonna rinse this out and um i don't know if i'm gonna put conditioner on it or not like some videos i see some people use conditioner other videos they didn't use conditioner they just rinsed it out and followed up with their styling products their moisturizer their leave-in that kind of thing um, I'm gonna kind of eyeball it see how my hair feels once I rinse it out and I will Come back and show you guys what my hair looks like regardless I'm gonna show you guys what my hair looks like with no product in it, Whether I decide to use conditioner or not so My curls were defined as y'all saw in the clip. It needs some more moisture now because 
She just pooping out. My hair doesn't feel stripped at all. I didn't put conditioner on it. it doesn't feel stripped. It feels clean. Like my hair chef feels really clean, but also um, moisturized at the same time. Um, I can't really explain it. You just have to see for yourself. Like you have to try it out and then see what I'm talking about. But yeah, I really liked it. The only downside is I don't feel like it really cleansed my scalp. Now that's probably because I really didn't focus um, focus it on my scalp as much like in certain areas I put it on my scalp other areas I didn't so that's probably why that is like that I'm feeling really good about this clay mask <clears throat> I would recommend it it's definitely a good cleanser for the hair to remove all the dirt all the oils everything like it gets it out of here okay so I definitely recommend that and yeah I would most likely be doing this again I don't know when maybe I'll do it like once a month but anywho I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give it a thumbs up also leave me a comment down below and let me know if you've tried this mask if you added any of your own oils to it because I've seen some people do that as well they added olive oil or jojoba oil and stuff like that to their mask before applying it on their hair let me know if you do that and also let me know of any other videos you guys would like to see just leave it down in the comment section down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already and don't forget to hit that bell so that you'll be notified every time i post a new video and i'll catch y'all in my next video bye